calm let's inspire hi guys so today we are going to fix the keyboard not working so if i try typing anything on the keyboard actually you can see pressing the windows button nothing is function so what i'm going to do now is i will take you to manage go to device manager and device manager let's look for keyboards so this is a keyboard installed the standard ps2 keyboard so the standard ps2 keyboard is not working so what we're going to do is since we can't use our keyboard we have to minimize this you go to your windows um let's use the windows is to access you bring your own screen keyboard so on the search bar let's try typing arrow e g so you're going to see a name called registry editor you click on the registry editor so on the registry editor so I'm sure to click on H key local machine. When you click on H key local machine, let's look for system. All right. So on system, let's look for current control set. This is current control set. On current control set, let's look for control. All right, so let's find class. Let's find class. So this is class. So if you click on class, you see that there are so many class. You see that there are so many class. Let's expand this for easy understanding. So I already find the location of which I'm going to work on. So you have to be going down from the first class right up to 28 class that has a name has a number 96b so for easy going i'll just screen i'll be screen this is it 96b 96b so all right guys so once you are this you ensure to move to this other side so we'll be working on this other side make sure your class is set to keyboard and the upper filter if it is empty ensure to follow me up if something is input there ensure to also follow me up so on our upper filters we are going to take modify so since i can't use the my keyboard so what i'm going to do is i'll bring the on-screen keyboard so i'll click here set the value data so the value data will be k b d class like this K B D class. So after that, you hit on. You hit on OK. So I'm going to close this. You see, warning: data of type cannot contain empty strings. Which the data will remove all empty strings found. Click on OK. So our uh, upper filters is set to K B D class. And uh, you just have to close the registry editor so move back to our computer management so you come now to the keyboard install what you're going to do is you pick up the driver say browse my computer for driver then you pick from the list you pick the initial one you click on next so successfully update your drivers we are going to click 
close. At this moment, still nothing is working, right? Nothing is working. So what I'm going to do is I'll restart the computer. After restart.